The Confederate battle flag is coming down from the South Carolina State Capitol. The State House overwhelmingly approved a Senate bill early Thursday calling for the flag to be removed. We stand here on this historic moment giving thanks to all those people that cross party lines that recognize that South Carolina need to be, needs to be in a better place and we believe that we are in that better place. The flag first went up at the state capitol more than 50 years ago to protest the civil rights movement. The issue came to the forefront after the murder of nine black people in a Charleston, South Carolina church. The alleged killer is a white supremacist who had posed with pictures of the Confederate battle flag. One victim, State Senator Clemente Pinckney, was on the minds of many representatives. The person that was killed in an act of hate had to pass under the very symbol of that hate. Republican Representative Jenny Horn, a descendant of Confederate President Jefferson Davis, made an emotional plea to bring the flag down. I cannot believe that we do not have the heart in this body to do something meaningful, such as take a symbol of hate off these grounds on Friday. Some Republicans tried to delay the flag's removal, but a bipartisan group defeated their efforts. Governor Nikki Haley says she'll sign the bill, which will mandate the flag come down within 24 hours. Sandy Kozell, The Associated Press.